I was going to make a big dick quote, but he already made a chest world joke or something like that. So we do have several items. We got a block of marble. We have the compass that wasn't here before. I don't... Where did it come from? Did we just grab it upon entering and I didn't notice? Uh, objects are already on the screen. Yeah, we know. Uh, the mandolin's there. Chalk's there. Okay, so these blocks of marble, we can do several things with them. Like, can we draw... No, we can't. We also have the block of wood, which increased in size, I think. This we can actually draw on, which is pretty nice. Hey, look at that outline. Nice. We can also grab this ink brush, and I think we need to use it on the marble. Probably. Or not? Oh, that's what I had to do. I just had to keep, like, messing around with it, and then suddenly, hey, the young pig has a crack in it. Uh, no. Now it's a piggy bank. Huh. Maybe we can do something with the coin. Can we put in the pig? And Othello is suddenly here. Or he was, and I just kind of sat there. Whoops. As if he wasn't already annoying enough. Okay, maybe I have to coax him with something. Hmm. I know I'm missing... Oop. I didn't mean to click out. God damn it. Yeah, I'm missing several... <gasps> oh! That's what I was missing. I need the can of paint that's here. Use the brush on the... Maybe I can use it on the wood? No? Um, okay, let's see. Can I grab the hammer with this one? No, I can't. Marble? Hmm. Okay, maybe I grab the hammer with this, and then... Grab the chisel with that? Yes. Okay, so that's how you can get past certain parts. You just need to... Do that? What is... Rabbit made of marble. I don't remember... Oh! I under... Not bad for a beginner, but it doesn't look like a killer. Um, where did I last, where did I save? Yeah, okay, let's try that again. Uh, I will cut when I have that progress back, because I do need to find out if the other hand did anything. Oh, there we go! It affected uh, Othello. Nice. Hmm. Okay, maybe the rabbit had to be done something else? Maybe we can dump him in paint. Chessboard? No? Huh. Can't drop him in there. There's something I'm missing. Hmm. Okay, I'm missing something, and I don't know what. Actually, oh, that's right, I never showed this. Rules of the game. The lover and the killer move one square at a time in any direction. The bowman 
moves one square but diagonally and on the lawn squares. The knight moves in a chess but avoiding the snake squares. The killer attacks the king diagonally. To win, the killer must eliminate the king and the lover must enter the tower. Yeah, so we have four pieces we need. We've got a bowman who is already actually on the field. Game can't start without the four main pieces. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, I need to do this part again. The wood. Grab the chisel and make this all over again. Or, actually, wait. Hmm. Maybe I need the left hand to do this? Okay, I need... I might need the hammer over here. Wood chisel? Eh, slow going, but hey, we're getting better. And Oh, we got the feet. We got the hands. Some hair? Hey! Who's this handsome fellow? It's a rough figure. Blount the rough figure! Let's dump him in paint, and... Hey, it's... Blount? Uh, it looks kind of soulless, though. Maybe we can use the ink on him? Hey, let's give him a goofy, f the goofy face, and we're all good. And move him all the way there. We got two pieces. Nice. But we're still missing a couple. Hmm. Uh, we still have a figurine, but something tells me we need to do something else. Huh. I'm gonna head back to the storybook because I want to say maybe we carried a few things. We have a horse. And we have... Huh. I'm wondering if I have to fail making that one sculpture and then do it again. They say how to figure the... <gasps> Oh, I just realized what I didn't do right. I think I was supposed to use the compass on the marble. That's why I messed it up. Probably. Okay. So, I'm going to head back and see if maybe that's what I was supposed to do. Still trying to think what I have to do with Othello. So he's still there? Oh. Hmm. Ah, come on. Okay, yeah, I don't think I can do anything about that yet. <gasps> oh, wait. No, actually, no. Let's go ahead and grab this and throw it in the trash because... Yeah, it doesn't look like a killer. So I didn't do that part right, and I think I just lost the block of marble. God damn it. Actually, no, wait a minute. I, I just realized. So, what I forgot to do was I need to call the knight out and then I can probably give him the horse. 
belly boom, dinka boom. Okay. Maybe now I can give him the horse? Yeah, that's what I had to do. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and show the aim of the screen and see if I've got everything. Yep, right there, the surprise spider, which you probably never would have thought about. And also, that's the executioner, probably. Uh, where bomb must fill the ink bottle, let other figures of the game, such as the bowman and knight, as well as blocks of wood and marble to make the main figures. So, I think we do have everything necessary. And I think the first time I played, I had no idea what I was doing. I don't know if this is just my memory coming back to me, or what the deal is. So, I think... I remember what I did wrong. I need to use... Yep. I do have to use the compass on the block. I have figured out exactly where to hit. So, if everything goes right... Grab the chisel. And... Boom! Hey, he looks familiar. Pretty sure he does. We also have the knight right there, so we have almost all the pieces. Just need to give the killer some paint scheme going on. Hey, that guy sure looks familiar. It's none other than Wild Blount, except a very soulless one, kind of like the other one. Or just like the lover, I should say. And I want to say that we have everything ready. Now we can enter the chest, which means we did everything right. Um, I'm not going to show the aim of the screen just yet. But now this is where you have to figure out the moves you need to make. Now the knight cannot um, be on the snake or dragon squares. So, you have to move everyone accordingly. And also, they make uh, interesting sounds. The bowman... Uh, what did it say? Let's see, the bowman moves one square, but diagonally and on the lawn squares. Okay, and I think he's... Yes. So we can move him right there. Yeah, we can't do anything about uh, the hangman. Okay. Can we put him on this one? No. Let's move him one more square back. See if he can pick someone off. Hey, we got rid of that guy and he just boings off screen and... And we got gold square. That's nice. Can we move the bowman? Get over there. Can he pick off the other one? From here. Oh, what's this, a lever? That's interesting. We also have a chaperon and... I think that's it. Let's see. The killer needs to go... Can we have him... <laughs> no, not yet. Oh. I don't know what that sound was, but... There's a square here. Can we have him do anything with that lever? Yes. We can get rid of the hangman. Nice. Uh, let's see. I can't... Can we move him here? Also, I noticed there's a grave, so that... You have to be kind of careful. Can we attack him? No. We can move this square. Hmm. 
I don't remember if we had to do anything about this guy. But... Hmm. Let's see, right there... Oh yeah, we we can actually give him the axe, and I think he will threaten the king. Okay, um, we have to move the lover over so that he will be able to attack. I didn't mean to do that, by the way. <laughs> I was trying to just move the bowman in a more favorable spot. Okay, so maybe I can move the knight over here and block one of the squares? Oh! I forgot there was a knight over there? Let's see. I'm going to try one more thing. I wonder if there was a knight on this square as well. Yes, there was. Hmm. Okay, so... Maybe I can move the bowman right here. Uh, come on, grab the killer. Yes, okay. Now let's give him the axe, or... Maybe move him back, and then move him back to where he was. Now, I don't know if this is going to work. Huh. Uh, grab the bowman. Maybe I have to have him on this square. Or maybe it's this square? Yeah, I think that's what I need because then he will be able to attack the king from that range. There, there's a lot of careful planning you have to take into consideration. Alright. One more. Okay, will this work? Okay, yep, and he's done. He gets chopped to pieces, and... See ya! Wow, okay, there's some weird layering issues. Um, hmm. Uh, where are you going? Uh, why did you... Okay, I guess I can't do anything with the knight. I'm not sure what's going on, but whatever. I don't think the chaplain has any purpose anymore, but I could be wrong. The princess is definitely in the tower. How can I get her out? Well, we can kind of help her help you out because we have uh the mandolin I thought I had the small one. Oh no, it was a bigger one. And that might have worked? I'm going to show the aim of the screen now, since we're at this point. Uh, the hands must manufacture the main figures, Blount the lover, and wear Blount the killer. Then they must win the game by seducing the princess and eliminating the king. And I want to say that we did just that? Uh, 
Uh, grab him? Uh, everything's on screen. Where's the mini Domelon? That's kind of weird. Uh, did I have to do anything with Othello? Okay, maybe we can grab him and... Uh... uh can, can we give him to the chaperone? No, we can't. I don't remember how to get rid of this guy. There's something I'm forgetting, and I don't remember what Othello's purpose was. Oh, I know what I might have did wrong. I think I had to do the uh, mandolin while he's right there. Or not? How do I get her out? Well, I thought I grabbed the mandolin. What's going on here? Oh, this is kind of annoying. Hmm. I'm like so close, and yet it feels like there's something else that I must do. Okay, I'm not sure how that happened. Let's take a look at this again. It's the story of a young lady who is waiting for a Prince Charming. Actually, maybe I should talk to her one more time. Ow. But that's not how I do it. It's not that. It isn't that. <gasps> oh! Okay, that's how I do it. I, it's like, I thought I saw the mini... Uh, mandolin, but it's like, did I just miss something? This will allow me to seduce my darling. Uh, wow, I could have sworn I already had that. Come on, let's go ahead and finish this. It, this has went on a lot longer than I was hoping, but at least I don't have to redo everything. Uh, never get used to this. Uh, give it to him. Uh, okay, maybe I have to put it down somewhere? Uh, what? Okay. Wait, now do I have to get Othello out of there? What? Uh. He thinks the music is divine. Okay. Can we grab him? It's a so. He has found a new home. He wants music. Okay. Oh, do we have to give it to him now? 
I don't recall that happening. There is something very obvious I'm doing. Wait. Is that a lever I see? Hold on. I'm gonna move him up there because I don't... Can we... Please stop doing that. Uh... Okay... Okay, so I think I might have read what I have to do, and I'm kind of a little upset because I thought I did this. Uh, no, that's the wrong hand. We do need Othello, and apparently we do need to put him on the board. We have to put him right there. And yeah, that's the last we see of Othello. And wouldn't you know, there is a Domelon Square. Ugh, I, I thought I did this and I apparently didn't or no I put him on the wrong square and it's like I don't think anything mentioned how so now we can put Blount here and now we can give him Domlon because you know you don't put it right at the square closest to the thing you put on a square with the thing uh oh uh, is that Bad singing? Oh, no, actually, we did good. She finally notices me. She invites me to enter the tower. And it only took, I don't know, 20 minutes of getting the whole thing wrong, so I'm going to be doing a lot of editing out just to get that done right. I think I showed the aim of the screen, so now we just set him here. He'll notice the key, and they get to make sweet love and that's it that is finally that area done and then we get into the second part this mess we have blount and a blount reflection so um i'm going to cut this part even though technically this is the other part but i do need to save and like yell at myself for probably doing the last bit wrong. I, I had to look it wrong, but... Yes, hi, Blount Reflection person. We know you're here. But uh, next time, we will get hopefully the last few screens and eventually complete uh, Goblin's Quest 3. So, uh, this has been Tappers, and I'll see you then. I'll give you attention next time.